A JT posted. Pitch that ball up there at the fourth. <laughs> and in. And plenty of ways to make a birdie, Fran, off to the uh, less than stellar tee shot. Trying to turn something in from right. Ooh, wow. It's the best we've seen. Trackman technology is presented by Titleist, number one ball in golf. That was all over it. it certainly was. Perfectly flag high, perfect greens. What do you think you're going to get? Night, night. Ekro. 17. Slow down. Oh. It's a way to slow it down. Hit what so he was aiming for. Just go ahead and bury it in the back of the hole. 17th. 198 yards today. Seems to be a pretty good tracer. How about the acoustics on that strike? Oh, the tourist back. Homa. That number's a little bit of a surprise. That plus two. That's going to change, though. Yeah, maybe all at once. Originally thought. Well, throughout. Throughout his career. Just the occasional 55 footer. Yeah, this turning right to left. Yeah, also going to miss to the right. Just briefly saw that, Karin. That looked very close. Great camera work there to follow that tee shot from Tommy Fleetwood, who's got a green under regulation. Adam Cole Schenk from 177. Oh, did he? Nearly. Hmm. Yeah, we just did it. Okay. That's it. The yeah. end of the list. Yeah. Sam Burns. He's number one. He's got Burns is going to be on the list. He's, yeah, he's like top five. Oh, a hell of a shot there from Sam going upstairs with it. Shane Lowry. Sugar Shane. We saw him get it wet at four. Let's see if we can improve at seven. Go in. Uh huh. You Somebody heard him. said you heard him. go in. Posted in his bag man, Aaron Fleener. He certainly created a great angle to this whole location. Far right side of the fairway, took advantage of it. And never a doubt there. It knocks it in with beautiful holding speed and back to seven under. Yeah. And this is Russ Henley. 17. Beautiful look from behind there and a beautiful tee shot from Russell Henley. At four in the par five. It's another one, mid range putt. Took advantage of it, rattled it home. He was four under in his first five holes. Seven under through the first ten today. Amazing start. Just a short iron here. Oh, hello. So it is going to get under. Starts hitting inside ten feet. Things change all of a sudden. And yeah, there's the ball striking. Rhythm, just great. Unique swing. Controls the clock face probably better than anybody else in the game at impact. Brian Harmon, one of 69 players in the field this week. Oh, there you go. The guy who had a good week last week, Morikawa, tied for third. And gets it to go at the second hole. So he's off to a good start. Got to take care of those par fives. These guys talk about it every week. This two iron. That from 272. That any good? 272 yards. <laughs> two on. <laughs> that shot. Wow. Arrow straight. These bunkers, the bottoms are really flat. This is pretty straightforward here. Yep. And he treated it as such. And oh, it goes in. 
McElroy with some early fireworks on a Thursday at the RBC. Shouldn't be much in it, just move a little bit to his left. Both men go from one under to three under. A pair of eagles at five for McElroy and Oberg. Back here at 13, Seamus Power from the back fringe for birdie. He's already made five birdies today. Can we get there? Yes, it is. Make that six birdies, no bogeys now for Seamus Power. Patrick Rogers from the long range. This is for birdie. There you go. <laughs> this is at the 15th, par five, Brendan Todd's third shot. That whole location in front. Right about there. Right in his wheelhouse. 17 again. Cantlay's tee shot a little further away than he would have liked. Great speed. Nice birdie earlier at 13 for Colin Morikawa. Let's see what he can do on the tee here. Yeah, this one's starting at the left center, trying to fade towards the flag. This looks really good. It's more what we saw two years ago, Aaron. Well, this is getting better and better. This could get really good. That is some. The best we've seen so far today. Well, we've been up here the last few hours. What a shot. Just not a lot of break in these greens. Gonna move to his left, if anything. Oh, how about it? Yes, sir! Well, that was only a 6% chance to make that putt right there, but he poured it right in the middle with a plenty of speed. And Morikawa's tee shot. Eight iron, great test for his swing with this flag on the left. He went to his go-to shot, which is that little cut, and another beauty out of Morikawa. Playing really well today. He's only missed two fairways on top of some good iron shots. Morikawa for birdie. Starting to look like the old Colin Morikawa. Boy, that was a confident stroke there. Just drops it out of the sky, allowing him about a 12 foot birdie putt. With a birdie birdie finish. And he moves to four under par. Alamorikawa is also in the mix. Again, we will see Scotty Scheffler and Jordan speak tomorrow here on Golf Channel. Good start for Rory McElroy. He's only four shots back after a 67. Thanks for watching the PGA Tour on YouTube. To watch another video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.